Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. Uh, this is the Stepford map. Last time around we got a line from Cabot Cove into this uh, Sunnydale Shangri-La Metroplex thing here. This time around we're going to push it on through to uh, Duckburg and possibly on to Jericho. Now we're also going to have <clears throat> eventually a uh, connection from Central City which doesn't which looks like the most um, logical connection point is going to be Jericho so I will uh, do that as well eventually so I'll consider that when planning the station at Jericho now here at Duckburg we just got a regular through station right uh, which uh, the question is how are we going to get the track around into there well, the track is coming out this way, so I think we'll want to come around and probably punch through the mountain here, and we'll be coming in this way. Okay, so that tells me that I probably want to put the station in here. Okay, well, let's uh, get rid of that. Uh, we'll grab a station with two tracks, and we'll wang it around, and we'll put it in at an angle... I pressed the wrong button. Yeah. And we'll put it in at an angle like about... So, and we'll raise it just a little bit. Yeah. We'll put it here. Yeah. And this is going to be Duckburg, right? Uh, yeah, it's going to be Duckburg. Uh, right, okay. So we need to connect that up to uh, the uh, street network. So we'll put one of these in. Yep. Um... And you can come in like so. No, you can go away. Yeah, that'll work better. Uh, you can come in like so. And then down like that. Yeah. Whoops. And then you can come... Really? Construction not possible? That... Really? Uh, okay, well, that is a connection. Okay, so uh, we'll take the lights out. Yeah, we don't need the lights, definitely. Uh, okay, so we're going to need to uh, connect uh, how much of the town... Yeah, it doesn't cover any of it. Okay, so we're going to need uh, to stick in uh, one of these... Uh, one of these, and I suppose down here also one of these. I think that probably gets enough of it, um, but I will do this. Uh, yeah, that pretty much covers everything. Okay, no, nope. we want to go in here, we want... No, we want one of these. Yeah. Yeah, you got to get your uh, trams on, on the line, right? Okay, stick that there. Good. Uh, right. That. Yeah. Good. Okay. Now we'll tramify everything. Uh, right, that, that's a little bit more tram track than we actually need, but that's fine. We're going to put a couple of these uh, trusty trams on here. New line, it's going to go here, here, and here. Yep, okay, so that, and that's uh, duck. 
uh, connector, right? Yep. And then we'll grab here. We'll put a couple more of our trusty little ones on here. Yeah. Okay. New here, here, and here. Yeah. So far, so good. Yep. Wait, what? No, I don't need that on there twice. Uh, okay. Duckburg Crosstown. Yeah. Okay, good. Well, let's get that rolling. Uh, now, uh, the question is getting the uh, train connection. I thought I was going to punch through here, wasn't I? Yeah, that's what I said I was going to do. What the? No. Uh, tracks. Yes. Uh, okay. Well. Oh yeah, that's not too egregious if I do that. Okay, how's that for... Yeah, that's perfectly fine. Do that. Yep. Now, we can come up here. Uh, if we go maximum up bubble, we get a viaduct, right? Uh, we don't need to have a viaduct, though. Um, no. Well, let's go from here and see what we get if we punch it through and do this. Um, I think I can accept that. Yeah, I think I can. As long as we head around that direction. Yeah. Okay, and then this will come around here. Right. And then this one will come around like this. Now, will they connect nicely if I do that? Ooh, that's pretty crazy. Okay. So if I back that up, back that up. What happens if I just wang that or Ah, that's better. That's way better. What if I do this? How bad's the cut? Um, yeah, I'll take that. You know, you've made a roller coaster thing over here. Yeah. That's why I'm bulldozing things. Ah, yes, I see. Okay. You're just going to wank. You no. Know, you're just going to wang that around here like this, right? Yep. That looks less bad. Okay. Well, that gets us a connection all the way around, and I did it on the wrong side at that end, didn't I? Uh, okay. Well, uh, we'll uh, bring the... Uh, track around here yeah it's nice having a couple billion in the bank uh, where you can build whatever you want no matter what it costs mostly uh, I know on the Dune Canyon map of the kernels uh, that uh, whatever it costs thing uh, turns out to be uh, a couple bits that are even a couple billion quid in the bank uh, as the kernel puts it uh, wasn't going to be enough to cover it. That Central Canyon and Dune Canyon was pretty uh, uh, aggressive. And building a bridge across it was pretty expensive. Uh, anyway. Uh, okay, so that gets a, uh, a line around up to Duckburg. Now, I think I do indeed have enough to uh, time at least to build the uh, station at Jericho as well so uh, we'll definitely do that 
so the station at Jericho, it's going to need to connect up around into this mess. Uh, and I think, well, I could punch through the mountain, but I think it would be nicer to go through the gap and come up at Bedford Falls. So that means we're going to be wanting the station to be angled a little bit this way. Because uh, we're coming this way. Yeah, so I'll put it over here. And then we can make a great curve and come down this way into Central City. So yeah, that's definitely doable. Uh, so uh, we'll grab a station with three uh, tracks, right? Face it around the right way. Uh, that seems like it might be appropriate right about here. Yeah, I'll put it here. This, okay, it called it just plain Jericho that time. Okay. And this time, I'm going to put a, uh, a proper... Uh, one of these in here. Yeah. So as if I put it this way. Yeah. Yeah, I can do it that way. Okay. Uh, right. And then we need to just connect the street. Yeah. Good. And then we're going to need to, uh, I don't know, put uh, some uh, uh, stops on here. Um, maybe over here as well. Yeah, I think that'll do for now. Okay, so you're going to need one of these. which you can put right here um which you did put right there and then you can connect it like this that's terrible no you're not doing it that way um right okay so you can do it like this yeah we can live with that one okay Good. Now we need to grab this, do this. Right. Now, uh, oh, this should just be called Jericho as well. Right. Now, what are we going to do? We are going to uh, buy a couple of trams. Bet you didn't see that coming, right? Uh, new line here, here. Right. And this is Jericho Commuter. Um, right. Now we need to get a train track over here now. I think if we uh, come out of here, yeah, that's what I was hoping for. Uh, if we come in, do this. Yeah, okay. Does this still work? Yeah. Yeah, I was hoping that would just go over the road. Yeah. Okay. Now, we kind of want to go around the foot of this. So... Uh, so we'll come around a little bit like this, and then a little bit further. Yeah, a little bit further. And then I think I can take, I can accept that as a speed. Uh, Actually, uh, let's try that again. Right. 
Now, if we come all the way around to here, uh, tolerable, I suppose. What if I do this? Yeah. Yeah, that's mostly tolerable except for this bit. I'll make that bit a viaduct. Yeah. We'll come down here, do that. Yeah, good. Uh, okay, so this will get the uh, connection point all the way. Um, I think I might need... Hmm. I wonder, do I, yeah, I definitely want to connect Central City into Jericho. Uh, I'll have to uh, look at that in the, uh, in the future there. Uh, what I'm going to do here, though, is, uh, uh, back that up. I'm going to see if I can get this to be, yeah, like this. Yeah, because this way, uh, this won't be as egregious. Yeah. Because we definitely need a turnaround here. So we'll uh, put the uh, requisite signaling on here. Okay. In case you're wondering why I'm putting the signals right at the station. Uh, it's to aid uh, through traffic if there's ever any. Uh, uh, through traffic doesn't see the implied signals at the stations, uh, which is uh, kind of annoying, actually. Uh, but by putting the, uh, the signals right at the station uh, ends, uh, you've guaranteed yourself a block uh, even for through traffic and that uh, that can uh, improve your uh, uh, results if you do have a train running through for some reason um, right here and here probably way more signals than I need right okay now we'll grab this line uh, manage vehicles and I think I'm going to want three on here where are you you're heading for ah okay well I think this will be the uh, uh, this is the project for this time, so I think this will be, uh, let's ride the train out to, all the way up to, uh, to the end point. Um, I need to adjust the line. Uh, okay, so we'll go in here, manage line. Uh, from here, we add a station up to here and here and then back down here right yeah okay that now we can ride the uh, the train here well that killed the time while we were riding the the line we've already looked at last time Okay, now we, uh, we come in to uh, Sunnydale Shangri-La and uh, 
we'll have a new track uh, heading out the other end. Okay. And we have uh, a few passengers here. They're probably waiting to go the other way. But they'll load up anyway, probably. Well, we're taking 101 passengers onward. Uh, that's a few. But I suspect most of them will stay on at the next two stations and ride all the way back. And that's just down to the fact that I changed the line, right? And uh, they won't have uh, re-established their uh, path, right? Because the path they're on will still get them where they're going. Okay, that was under the freight line. And now we've got the long mountain... Uh, uh, crossing here. The trees do uh, nicely to disguise the edge of the map in the distance as well. Because uh, you're looking at the trees instead of the edge of the map, right? Now, as of the time I'm recording this, which is uh, mid-December, uh, there's a beta branch of Transport Fever 2, which has a new uh, graphics driver using the Vulkan API. Uh, and uh, there are reports that it substantially improves game performance. Uh, uh, so that may, uh, that may help on maps that are busy, like with, uh, with this one with lots of trees. So that'll, that'll be uh, interesting. I haven't tried it because it's uh, a little bit uh, dicey to try a beta release with a uh, save that you want to continue using. So I haven't tried it, but uh, it might be worth uh, loading it up and seeing if, uh, if I can get uh, fast speed to uh, actually work on this map uh, again. But I haven't tried it yet, and it's a bit of a pain. Because you have to switch to the beta branch, and then you have to let the game update, and then you have to do your thing, and then, then you have to switch back off the beta branch, right? So, uh, yeah, I'm probably not going to do that. We do have people on this platform. So I think we'll pick up one or two here. Four. We picked up four. That's a good sign, though. Uh, it's an indication that it's actually connected, and that's uh, that's good. So that's Duckburg. Now we just need to uh, make our way around to um, what you might call it, uh, Jericho. It says right on the screen, and you know what you might call it. Yeah, it's seriously, man. Uh, it's right there on the screen in front of your face. Now, I should change the name of this line to refer to Jericho as well. There's the uh, road between the uh, cities and the valley floor there. And uh, we're coming, we come around here. Yeah, it's, uh, I think this is, uh, I think this, this is uh, actually uh, worked out nicely. Having, uh, having these uh, rail lines here should, like, if I get the whole map uh, interconnected with rail lines, and then add in uh, a couple more strategic air, air airports and airlines. 
I could well uh, uh, solve uh, much of the traffic problem that the map is having uh, just from the network effects, right? Uh, with the, uh, the transport options improved, there will be less need to drive to the slightly further destinations, which will reduce the congestion on the roads, uh, which... Uh, uh, you know, it's even if 10% if of the, uh, the simulated people take the uh, train to another town instead of driving there, well, that could make all the difference, right? So, because uh, I've noticed a lot of the uh, towns in the congested corner, uh, the problem is actually uh, through traffic. Uh, and uh, I think the through traffic is because I'm just not serving the destinations they want to go to, right? So once I get all of the cities connected with uh, rail lines and uh, a couple more uh, airports, I think perhaps uh, that might uh, solve the worst of the uh, of the traffic, or at least give me a handle on it. But we still do need some slightly better um, tools for managing traffic on roads, like uh, or manually setting the turns. Uh, manually setting uh, which direction gives way and which one doesn't so that an uncontrolled intersection isn't just a free-for-all. I don't know uh, about where the developers live, but around uh, my part of the world, uh, an uncontrolled intersection is not a free-for-all like you see in the game. Uh, well, it might be, but uh, we, don't, we don't do them because they are problematic and that you do have accidents at them uh, and that uh, that itself is a good reason to uh, uh, to uh, have some better uh, controls yeah okay so this line is uh, is working out uh, pretty good uh, I'm, I'm reasonably happy with how that's uh, come out uh, yeah it's uh, well, we've got us uh, two more uh, towns on the uh, rail network. Uh, what'll be interesting, though, is when I when this this bit of rail network across the uh, the bottom of the map, as we've been looking at it, uh, it'll be interesting to see what happens when I get this up to Stepford. Uh, is that's going to make uh, all the difference? I think. Uh, it will suddenly end up with a huge pile of uh, passengers, I think. Uh, and it might overwhelm the uh, existing links. I may have to spend some time off camera uh, balancing things a bit. Uh, hard to say. Anyway, uh, I'm actually going to call that, call that the end here. Because this, this uh, particular uh, project here, it's done. Uh, so... I'm not sure what the uh, the next one's going to be exactly, uh, but uh, there is a little bit more to come, so I'll definitely be uh, be doing that. Uh, I'm still ruminating on what I'm going to do for the next map. Uh, this map may have more life in it than I thought, though, uh, and I'm definitely going into the new year with this one, and uh, and then. Uh, I do have a new map that I'm still waffling on what I'm going to do with because I think I think I'm going to want to grab some mods and uh, uh, you know adjust the way the uh, stuff behaves so I don't end up with the uh, nasty complication that I've got in it now. It doesn't look that good. I'm not happy with it. Uh, it's not the map itself. It's the industries. Uh, so I'm definitely going to have to think about it some more. So this map having more life, that's good. So see here, we got lots of uh, passengers here uh, waiting for uh, heading on to uh, uh, Cabot Cove. So well, we're not going to pick most of them up here. Uh, yeah, we're only picking up, uh, you know, eight or ten of them, right? Uh, so, uh, hopefully a train behind us uh, uh, can clear out the platform. Uh, there should be a train behind us. Yeah, there is. 
And that one shouldn't be full. No, it's not. Okay, yeah. So that will uh, that will start to clear out the uh, the platform. Yeah, I might need more trains on here, and that's fine. There's there's room on the uh, rails for it. Anyway, uh, that's uh, that's going to be all for for this time. So uh, you know, stay healthy. Don't let the uh, ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. Uh, but keep in mind, there's uh, a light at the end of the tunnel, apparently. And, of course, see you back next time.